choose one of you, then I lose the other. I can't bear the thought of losing one of you. Love is a twisted and interesting thing. It doesn't have a certain beginning, and it certainly has no end. It just happens. But what you don't learn is how hard love is. How much of ourselves we have to put into it. You've unknowingly put your life, your heart, into another person's hands and say, Here, break it if you want, or forget I ever handed it to you. Forget. Love happens to everyone. It's inconvenient and painful and devastating at times, but we can live without it. Yet, sometimes, it's better when we forget about it. <laughs> it would be great if loving someone can work as a switch, so you can turn it off and forget. Forget. We try to keep her safe, but she doesn't eat, she doesn't sleep. I'd like to run some tests. Maybe it's better if you just leave her here. She can't be here. She'll miss playing music and... Nick, she hardly remembers us. Or anything. You think she'll remember how to play an instrument? You can quit if you don't try. Believe me, I understand your frustration, but it's possible something was missed. I can't. It's, it's too much. She doesn't remember loving me or choosing... Choosing you? Yeah, but let me tell you something. Forever means until death tears you apart. New Flash, she is not dead. If you want to know, it's better like this. Thank you. If I choose one of you, then I lose the other. I can't bear the thought of losing one of you. You don't have to choose. Yes, I have to because... I back down. You both are perfect for each other. You'll always be Joe. I know. So, we're still friends. Best friends. You're in the hospital? You were in a car accident? I don't know who you are! Get out! We are married! I'm your husband! No! No! Get out! I would never marry when I want a singing career! She lost part of her memory. It'll be hard to get it back, but not impossible. Her memory is going to improve with time. It's useless. Are you feeling, Miss Jonas? Don't call me that. I don't remember ever getting married. Call me Demi, or Miss Lovato. So, you still have a lack of memory? I wouldn't call it a lack of memory. Well, one person offered to help. Hey there, Demi. Finally, someone who calls me by my name. Well, half of it. He offered his help. I'll leave you two alone. What's your name? I'm Nick Jonas. You are my... Brother-in-law. Look, this whole I married and Jonas wife thing is so confusing, and I really don't want to talk about it. I want to go to my classes and learn to play guitar yes, and... it's alright. I'm not here to make you remember you're married. I just want to help you. You already play the guitar and piano. And very good. <laughs> I play the piano and the guitar? Yeah, and I'm just here to help. After all, we are best friends, Zams. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I mean, you love him, he loves you. Everything is <clears throat> great. Really? Yeah, after all, we are best friends, Zams. Is everything okay? Yeah. So you're going to help me? Exactly. I'm here as your friend. So... <laughs> what? Let's get out of here. <laughs> Is that allowed? <laughs> the Demi I know takes risks. Let's take a risk together.
Jessup. What, Miley? Have you seen Nick? I've called him all week. He just won't answer. Uh, I've seen him just a couple of times. I thought he was with you. How is Demi? I really don't care. She forgot about me. I'm just making the arrangements to get the divorce. Joseph, you loved her. She loved you. How? Exactly. She loved me. Not anymore. How can you be so sure? <sighs> I just do. Finally, you show up. Where were you? I'm sorry. I was busy. Busy? We were worried. Your phone was off and honestly, it's been like this for two weeks now. Are you cheating on me? What? No. I wouldn't do that. Then what the hell is going on with you? I, I just can't say it. I'm sorry. Fine. Don't tell me. Fine. Dude. No, Joe. Don't try to give me an advice when your wife is at that place and you didn't even show up. <laughs> I'm being serious. Damn, those lyrics are mine, not yours. You are taking advantage of my lack of memory. I'm sure as hell I wrote this. <laughs> yeah? Wanna bet? Something's creeping inside. Everything is about to change. See? Everything is about to change. I wrote it. I gotta face the fact that I can't walk away. Again, I wrote it. Baby, you're the air I breathe. Wow, this has so much passion. Yeah, I wrote it on a particular time, actually. I knew it. Miley? Miley, hi. Nick talked about you and- Yeah, yeah, you forgot it was our anniversary? Uh, I'm sorry, my- I- Just forget it. Go. I'll be here anyways. Miley! Wait up! I got it, Nick. Demi needs you. She's your best friend. But what about me? Am I nothing to you? It's not that I love you. You just don't understand. She's- Look, Nick, you told me you were just helping her. So one day Joe can come and she might recognize him, but Joe doesn't even know you're coming here playing instruments with your sister-in-law. I'm so sorry. You don't have to say sorry. It just hurts that you can't tell me what your heart really feels when it's just so clear. Or over if it's not obvious. Demi. She is right though. I know. Maybe it's better if we don't see each other until Joe, well, my husband, knows about this. So he told you? Yeah, but it's better if she doesn't remember me. Why? Because I'll never be the same. I think... I think I already lost her. Nick, it's... oh. Hey. Hi. Good, you don't want to kill me or anything, huh? <laughs> yeah. I was rude, sorry. Not taken. I will be scared too if I woke up and find out I'm married to a stranger. Thanks for understanding. You and Nick have been together all these months. Did all that help or...? I remember most of it. 
Yeah, he helped. A lot. I'm glad, um... Why he? Why not you? If you loved me that much, why was Nick the one who stood beside me, against the odds? You really gave up on me? On us? Excuse me, I, I thought you... <sighs> Nick never lost hope, and yeah, he was right. I should have fight for you, stood beside you. Don't get me wrong, I love you, Demi. I never stopped loving you. Loving someone is not just saying it, it's showing it. How much do you remember? I remember us getting married, planning the future, happy in love. But I also remember Nick. He backed down. You both offered me love. I chose you. It was never about choosing Demi. But I have to admit it. I was glad to choose me, but in these months I have come to realize that you chose the wrong brother. I guess I never should have chosen. You're both great guys. Maybe I really need a break from you two. Maybe. I'll just tell you something. I... In your heart should be with someone who truly believes in the world forever. So she just left? Yeah. She got divorced, and now she can start a new life and all. If she'll do that, then you can too. Miley, my love for her will never go away. So you love her, but you let her go? I really love her, even if it's a distance, forever. Um, I should just go. Dance? I couldn't get on the plane. I can see that, but why? How can I start a new life away from my best friend? How can I expect to fall for someone when I already fell for my best friend? Maybe I've been waiting for too long. Maybe I've been searching for someone wrong because I can't believe that I had you and I chose your brother when you clearly loved me. And I guess I didn't want to believe that I loved you too. Because I do. Demi, I... Let me finish. You are my best friend. My shoulder to lean on. The one person I know I can count on. You're the love of my life. You're my one and only. You're my everything. Demi, I love you. I can't marry the thought of losing you. I want to make you happy, and I will dedicate my life to do that. You're the only one I'll ever love. Look, I will never stop holding your hand. I will never stop losing my breath when I see you. I will never stop looking at you and get lost in your eyes. I will never stop loving you. Love makes us crazy. It makes reality invisible. It takes a lot of work and fighting. But I learned that all the fighting and all the tears and all the uncertainty is worth it. Because you can't find that someone who will show you that there is a huge difference between feeling happy and feeling whole. Love does not begin and end the way we seem to think it does. Love is a battle. Love is a war. Love is growing up. Love is the beauty of the soul. I know what you were thinking. So, you can damn you got married at all. He is too soon to tell. I don't think I'll ever see an ending to that. Nick showed that forever means he loved her then, he loves her now, and he will always love her. I would gladly be waiting for her. Forever.